when I was a young teenager in high school um, I was in a Christian home my parents were Christians and we went to church I had accepted the Lord um, but then when I got out of school and got away from home I had gone into nurses training and all the girls there smoked and so I started smoking right along with the rest of them and even though I quit nurses training and went on about other things I still smoked and did for a good number of years after that uh, in 1956 my husband and I and my kids uh, started going to the Foursquare Church in the town we lived in in California and um, we got saved I gave my heart back to the Lord and my husband got saved my kids got saved and and um, everything was going fine but then the Lord showed me that I needed to quit smoking that that wasn't a good uh, testimony and uh, he finally let me know that if I didn't quit smoking I would lose my testimony entirely I'd lose my Christianity and um, I, I know that he doesn't require that of everybody but he did require it of me I tried and tried and tried to quit smoking and uh, I couldn't those of you that smoke know that it's one of the hardest things to do is to quit a habit that you've been in the habit of doing and uh, I would get down on my knees and and pray that Lord would take them away from me and every day and uh, it just went on and finally after about three months one morning I got down by my bed and I said Lord I'm gonna stay here until you take these cigarettes away from me and help me get rid of them and I hadn't been there very long until all of a sudden I realized that he had just taken them away from me completely they it was gone the desire to smoke was gone I jumped up out of my off of my knees and went running out my back door to my neighbors and in her back door hollering that the Lord had delivered me from cigarettes <clears throat> after that I never had another desire to smoke uh, and to this day I still don't have a desire to smoke and he can do the same thing for you this is Frida White and I once was a slave to cigarettes but now I'm unquestionably free